Yo, 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 what's happening, guys? Matt vs Mullen here, how are we all today? We're about another video, we're currently in LA right now. Uh, looking over the map, it's been a really another uh, good day in Upland, so right now if we actually go over to messages, uh, you can see here we've got a couple of the sales, including my property I had in San Francisco as well, that sold as well, so you can see we sold that one, where did we sell it? Just before, I put into Tycoon, was it just before or just after? I think it was just after actually 15 10 9 10 15. yeah here so this one here uh, to umbrella boy was a san francisco property that's the one i've minted from the pass the first pass so that's cool i've still got the pass as well and then also we just sold this as well i basically bought this for about 24 dollars 23 dollars about a couple of months ago and then that's just sold for 50k as well so like we basically made about 50,000 000 upex profit including obviously the sponsorship deals as well so if you do want to jump on and become a sponsor you can just send 10,000 000 upex over to james uk and then get yourself a slot blocked off automatically for whatever day you choose and then you can advertise your content for 30 seconds on this youtube channel so yeah that's available now going through this year as well going forward and then basically tycoon has been our main thing we've been on currently if we go over to it now the maximum you can get is 50 daily loot boxes now which is cool so we collected i think we got about eight energy um just from like the sorry no we got five energy and then we also got about 30 lumber and then we also got about 15 to 18 ore as well and then we've just sold that in the store on top of like the resources he's produced as well so if we actually go over to logs uh, you can just see some of the transactions in the last couple of minutes uh, just going through the account which is really nice uh, just to see so that's brought the tycoon account up to 43,000 now so i'm still debating what to do with the money as well and i'm still waiting for my other windmill i got another windmill the other day and you can see here we got a research facility built for us as well so now we can start to produce schematics as well but we should really have 15 energy because i bought another property with a windmill on it but you can see it's not like they've lied about the property or anything because it's not even showing up in here as well even when i refresh the page uh, that property is like disappeared and you can still see it's only got 14 windmills so if we actually go over to upland um, and then i go over to assets and then i go over to structures and then if i actually where is the property here so the small townhouse over here 14 and a half thousand just bought that uh, and that's got the one node slot on it but this actual dress is under my name here but it doesn't actually show up on uh, tycoon so like someone's nicked my windmill um, you can see the three here so it's not in there you can even see up here structures without node slots it's not there and then also there's no empty node slots either so i'm still waiting on it coming through which is i'm still wondering like what's happening because this research facility was bought as well and this came through straight away uh, so yeah i don't know where the other windmill is and then we definitely had 6, 12, 14. We definitely had 14 before we purchased that windmill as well. And now we've got that property with the windmill, but it's just not, even the property is not showing up. So um, there's just nothing. It's not even in the other nodes as well. If we look in here, there's no empty node slot or any property or anything else. So that's going to be um, interesting to see where that is because I don't actually have a clue uh, what's happening with that. So we're basically just going to keep. Uh, keep selling all the resources off until obviously the loot boxes go down through the week and then basically by the end of the month we should be able to clear close to like 270,000 right now 280,000 with the market rates uh, so that'll be cool to add to the account and also with the sponsorships the visits and then also property sales is up right now noticed a big difference in upland recently you know just with sales and stuff it was kind of uh, running a little bit slow like just a sale now and then you know just kind of like a slow burn but now it's starting to pick up again i've noticed a few more sales on the account as well so uh, yeah it's cool to see these sales coming in and then everything else is just been tycoon based really and my dilemma now is do i actually put the resources in and actually start building more nodes and then like wait for the market because if i invest now and then build more nodes up is the market going to stay strong for another two three months uh, the more you kind of invest the longer it stretches out the return 
Uh, so yeah, I just want to kind of keep an eye on the markets because right now you can see lumber is 67, ore is sitting at 68, and then energy is coming back up nearly close to like 300. It was sitting around 310, it went down to 290 uh, kind of price. So what we're going to do is sell our one energy as well because we don't need it right now. And then we'll sell that for 295, just adding onto the account as well. And then when I realize what I want to do with the UPEX, that's when we'll actually start to uh, move it over or like put it on a spark contract or other stuff as well. I'm just still having a look, seeing what's going on, you know, with Tycoon and just reading the kind of the markets. Uh, once we really like, understand where the market is and how it's going to be going forward, uh, that's when we kind of jump in as well. And that's good last time we've done that as well we didn't just like start straight away and build loads of nodes the market dropped and then at that point we was able to get like nearly an extra 20 30 percent uh, because obviously the prices went down so we've managed to like get the resources a lot cheaper uh, so we'll probably just kind of go down that strategy again as well and just see what actually uh, happens with kind of the game and stuff so but really excited looking forward to it also got our season pass as well well we got two of them if we actually go over to assets here you can actually see it's under legit and then we've got two of them here as well so we've got one to burn so we can actually get the um you, whatever they're called again uh, cosmetics yes i remembered this is one 1000 so i might keep this one because this is the closest one to mint and then i think this was the other one here 2000 uh 700 and two, 27, 430 what you can do is you can click out to zoom it up we'll actually show the totem again quickly just so you can actually see that design it looks so nice actually really a big fan of these so i've got two passes one to keep and not burn and then the other one's going to get burnt and i'm going to do that all through the month uh, all through the year sorry for the six different seasons uh, uh, we'll burn this one right now you just click the burn button and then remember you can't like get it back if you burn it that's you and now every tuesday you'll get a drop and then every single Tuesday 9 a.m. they'll take a snapshot and then you'll get a drop so going on for the, like the six weeks kind of thing going forward if you don't burn it on the first week you won't get the first drop it will go on to the second week so make sure you burn it before 9 a.m. on Tuesday so yeah that's basically how uh, you can get into that so really looking forward to it gonna keep collecting the passes and then we also get a badge as well so uh, that badge will go nicely here as well hopefully we can just at least get three and then get a spark up to three as well and then this account's going really well we're so close to getting our 10 million uh, once we start investing in like more properties and stuff as well we'll actually go over quickly and have a look at the granada hills market for dollars I've got a couple of properties the other day um, and it was really good actually getting some good properties at good prices and that so hopefully there's some more we can quickly have a look at granada hills and then if I go into status and then we'll go for dollar and we'll just check it quickly you can see now the sale price is there's one at five dollars thirty seven um, 80 up to 55 percent and these go down as well what's the best markup 47 percent they're all Granada Hills as well 47 47 47 that one's a good prop here we'll have a quick look at this one now the search is back on the desktop as well i noticed that wasn't working when i was on my phone treasure hunting the other day so it's nice to be able to just like visit to the properties again really quickly so this one's bringing in 185 so yeah really happy with that and it's a good location to start building on to like a structure and other stuff as well with the developing area it should be a little bit easier to sell as well if we want to flip it uh, so there's a lot of opportunity for this property so we'll get this one as well and then looking forward to seeing what actually happens with the OPEX like gamified mechanics and that and like seeing what the percentage is and the pay and uh, just loads of kind of stuff with that. Really interested to see what actually happens with that going forward. And then we'll just get this one. And then I'll get that as well. Basically getting like a few properties in Granada Hills now and then we'll also spend this 115,000. We'll get a few more properties. Uh, with that and then that's basically I was in a really good position this year going forward um, Granada Hills is going 
really well. A lot more players are coming on now. I believe we're at 87 members as well, so if you want to jump on, the link is in the Discord down below. Uh, join the community chat, sell properties, all that good stuff as well. And then we're doing lots of stuff with Tycoon and then also like property and Spark as well. So click that link and then you can also get 50% off in the description as well if you want to sign up to Upland. Upland's a property virtual trading game. Every property is mapped to the real world. And then you can get 50% off your first purchase up to 100,000 Upex if you use the link down in the description. Uh, once you buy Upex from the store on your first purchase, uh, yeah, take good um, good effect of that if you've already not already signed up to Upland and you want to start playing Upland. So, yeah, as you can see, like it's mapped to the real world. I'm currently in, in LA and I plan to do most of my business in LA going forward. And then once we get to our 10 million as well, we'll be in such a good position. We'll get a 1.2 Spark as well for upgrading on Spark Week. So that'll be 4.1 basically, but by that time comes, we'll already hopefully be at about 4.2, 4.3. So that'll be a really good place to get to as well. Push Granada Hills, we're still waiting on the racetrack and then the factory once we get 5 Spark as well. And then with Granada Hills, we'll look at... We'll go back to this quickly and then we'll change this to Upex and then non-FSA because if your account's over 100,000 Upex, you can't purchase FSA properties. So let's actually have a look at the secondary market as well. For sale... Upex... Yeah, let's have a look at these ones. The floor right now is 9,395, so we can change that. Uh, we'll get this property, and then basically these cost a little bit more, but then like it means like the floor is going up, and like the floor price right now from minted property is non-FSA is about 13,000, 13,200. Um, so if I'm buying the property, is at about 10,000 to 12,000. You know, the floor is going to be close to 12, 13,000 going forward. And then anyone else what drops properties, we've got enough OPEX coming in now every single week to uh, just buy those properties up kind of thing and keep the market more stable and the economy more stable in Granada Hills. So the bigger this account gets, the more like gentle the rise will be instead of these kind of like up and downs. So, uh, yeah, really looking forward to that. And then every single month we get this account bigger, it'll just naturally uh, compound as well. So every single week Granada Hills is going, it'll just get stronger and then more OPEX to circulate in the economy. So yeah, this will be cool next year, the year after and the year after that as well. So it's continually going to keep growing. So if you want to join on Granada Hills, you can do as well. Like the Discord is down below in the link in the description. But yeah, jump onto that, give me a message, chat to the community. Just say hello, see what's up. So and then now the floor is sitting at 10,000 again, which is which is not bad, then it goes up to 10,100 here. See these markups, I'd rather get a few more FSA prop, unminted properties, sorry. Um, not FSA. And then basically minting out Granada Hills a little bit further. And then you can see the price is nearly now at like 13,300. So we'll just see how many more of these properties we can actually get. And then that raises the floor even further as well, so it's going well. And then everybody what gets in, the earlier you get in, the like more kind of like benefits you can actually get from the properties that you buy and the properties that you mint in Granada Hills because the floor is always going to go up slowly over like months and months and months. Some months it might go down obviously if we don't buy the dip, but the next month once we get some more money and other stuff or upex and stuff, we'll just keep purchasing the dip and it gets easier and easier the more we kind of go at the games. So. Uh, yeah, jump on Granada Hills if you want to join a new node in Upland. Let's get this property, see what this is about. And that one's gone through, and then we'll take this one as well. Should have turned that off, actually, I didn't realise I'd be um, buying so many properties and that, but when I woke up this morning and seen that Upex coming in, I was over the moon to see, yeah, both of those big properties sold what was sitting there for a while, so. Uh, yeah, that was really cool to see. So let's confirm that one as well. And then back to work tomorrow. So we'll be back tomorrow night for another video and that, but it won't be till later on. Hopefully about this time again, because it's currently 11 o'clock in the UK, 11 p.m. Uh, so basically just been out, like went to McDonald's with a partner and stuff and got some shopping. Just had a really good evening and that jumped back on to film this as well, talk about Tycoon. And then the Discord as well, still trying to sell that totem as well, so I think I bought it for $50, so anything close to like $50 or 75 to 100,000 Upex. If you've got any Node Tycoons or other stuff, just give me a shout in the Discord or other places, James UK on Upland as well, you can. 
uh, get me there as well so if anybody wants a totem it's yours it's a brown palm tree so uh, yeah loving the game of Upland but just really want to get back to the property side I can't do the totems so uh, yeah that's going bye bye now let's get that one there I believe it was yep and then once we get that one one seven so now we've got a new floor at just under 13,300 so yeah awesome we'll get a couple more properties and then I might leave myself like five ten thousand up next I don't know why but I might just actually spend it to be fair these two properties look very similar oh no they don't one's got an L on it I don't know what kind of L that is it's a J <laughs> but yeah by the J and then that one's 13,298 And then let's actually have a look how much is this lot? 13,664. We'll get it anyway because it's close, saves us going over to the other one. And then property search, so we're sitting at this one, so now we need this one as well. And then yeah, we'll basically be able to get two more properties. We will just get two more properties. And then yeah, we've basically bought probably five last night five tonight and then uh, these minted properties as well and then we bought a few last night so yeah the account's going well the account's pushing up certainly this month and then next month will be even better oh, i've run out of sends i need to get a property near my car where should i go over here this these look all right let's have a look send over to these ones obviously I've run out of visits but you can send to your own property for free so um, yeah taking advantage of all my properties in LA right now especially for treasure hunting and other stuff in the game oh these are 21,000 how much is this one 23,000 I do like that location though so we'll get that one as well and then yeah we'll finish up with that one as well now we've got both corners of the actual close as well we could build up a couple apartments or other stuff would be nice around this kind of corner 284 up eggs every single month as well in yield and now we've still got that 40,000 in tycoon if we wanted to move it over we could do and start building or we could actually like build with the node contracts in tycoon so it's totally up to us now what we do on this channel and see where we go but like yeah the opportunities are starting to open up now with uh, the OPEX returns and other stuff, especially with sponsors and that. So yeah, got the account up to 143,664 now, which is really cool. And then Tycoon's bringing in about eight to 10,000 OPEX every single day. And then we'll just basically look at different strategies through the year. I've got my diary now as well, so I'm actually organized and a new pen as well. So we can actually write stuff down, organize different like kind of filming schedules. And yeah, basically just try and get my life in order and like get everything more structured because uh, with work and everything going on it's just like there's a lot going on so it'll be nice to actually like not plan the videos i do like to film these videos live as you know like kind of as i go but i don't i like to maybe have some notes or some structures and all the sponsorship ideas and all that kind of stuff i'll put into the the diary and stuff so i can actually keep track of it more easier as well so yeah that'll be cool going forward and then we can do like discounts and like say you buy five slots for an advert you can get a discount or a free slot or all those kind of different loyalty ideas going forward as well that we can give back to you guys so yeah click that subscribe button if you're not already to win all these competitions and just find out some amazing content about upland uh, like the video share the videos it really does help the channel grow uh, reach more people we're trying to hit 600 subscribers we're so close right now and then we're going to push for a thousand and then get monetized and then just reinvest that avenue that like income stream back into upland as well and just see where we can get this account over the next couple of years over the next 10 years so uh, yeah click that subscribe button guys thank you so much for all the support hope you're killing it with tycoon uh, hope you got your season passes as well remember to burn them before tuesday so you can get all those goodies as well so yeah thank you so much for the support guys i'll see you tomorrow for another video metaverse melon peace